Yo, what is up, everyone? Welcome back to Get Jacked. Now, today, we're continuing off here on official, and we've got a lot of stuff to do. We're starting out in the frozen tundra here just because we tamed up this Capra Suchus. We got our makeshift raft going, and I also got a ton of gunpowder. I filled up, like, three full storage units of gunpowder, so we've got... Wait. Oh, seriously? Come on. I think the... Yeah, the Capra's on passive. Always after me. Really chasing the penguin off. Am I gonna survive? This is like really cold water. Is he off of me? I think I can get onto the cap row. Oh god. This is really, really glitchy. I I, apolo I I do apologize. There we go. Okay. Well, saw that one coming. Okay, I just need to get rid of this pig. I'm gonna like see if I can actually kill it with this capra suchus. I may eh, I probably should be able to since it's in there. Either that or it'll just swim away right when I've, yep, right when I've wasted enough time on it. Okay, yeah. We're just going to put this guy right here. And basically, what we're after out here is we need a lot of metal. It's really easy to get on foot out here. We also need a lot of electronics if we want to get a generator and stuff going. Actually, let me put this guy... I want to make sure he's, like, situated somewhere where he's just not going to get freaking bitten by something. Nope, can't get him on top. But, I don't know, basic raft. Just kind of been sailing it around this whole time, so it hasn't really been too big of an issue. Just trying to get everything that we need for this. Maybe just, like, one or two turrets and a generator would be really nice. But, anyway, I've got all my storage up here but i can't really get to my body oh oh there it is there there we are okay i lost that for a bit all right anyway let's go all right so i figured i'd make some large crop loss i'm getting a lot of like stone because i'm getting a decent amount of crystal and oil out here actually the oil on land i think was like reduced because there's very little per node that i'm getting so i'm not sure about that but Let's get a few crop plots going, just because when we get to where we are going to stay for a bit, we will have some of those for Plant Species X. Anyway, I got the fabricator here, had someone fast travel into my raft to build it, because I wasn't quite high enough, but I had the resources. So we've got that, and we've got a generator. Alright, we parked the raft over here on Carno, and we're just killing all the stuff around here. It's actually kind of nice over on this island because it's out of the way. We've got a little metal one by one. Actually, we've got one group of people out on a raft. Um, they're farming up some metal over on the mountain over there. And we've got this raft just for like basic stuff. So the metal one by one, we'll just do like a generator, maybe like one or two turrets if we're feeling like it to protect our rafts if we're here for a bit of time. Oh, I just saw the sun coming in. Didn't even notice I didn't put a freaking sealing on right there okay whatever it'll, it'll be all right i just want to get a few little things I, I did that little wood one mostly for just a few preserving bins so we could get some jerky going i don't really want to be here for very long but we're just setting up some basic structures so that we can get like all the stuff that we need so we've got one group out getting metal we've got i don't i, I don't want to say tames because i'm Look at those guys, they're, they're weak. We can't even get a saddle for the RG quite yet. That's actually one thing that we're working on. So we will get there here soon. We've got a decent long neck and some ammo just in case anything happens. But it's actually only a few hours in still. So we still have quite a long way to go. This is, this is definitely a good start though. Okay guys, so I'm setting up a little bit of a farming platform here, but things have changed things have things have really changed so everyone when we were on the island we were all setting up some stuff and it was kind of come it, it kind of came to like a mutual agreement that everybody just kind of wanted to play on Ragnarok i think so everybody headed over to Ragnarok got everything all set i took a little bit of a nap after playing for like a a 900 minute session or something crazy like that and uh after that came in and now setting up on Ragnarok. So I figured this would be probably best. I know there are a lot of people looking forward to more Ragnarok stuff. So we'll be here for a bit. Hopefully we can get some stuff done over on this server. I, th I think it'll be pretty fun. We, we just figured the island was just, 
uh, first it was slot capped at all the like at all times so people who wanted to get in and people who would like dc'd just could not get into the server so we found one that we could actually get into so this is, this is a little bit nicer everything what, are you swinging? what the heck turkey oh there's an emote that does that noise isn't there i was, <laughs> I was confused for a second ragnarok does not have a turkeys yet now unfortunately ragnarok doesn't have the phoenix or will not have the Phoenix. It's not quite released into the game yet, but it won't have that. So we'll have to go over to Scorcher maybe at some point and get that. But otherwise, this has got like everything we need. I'm trying to get more charcoal going. We did, we did get a lot of the gunpowder over here, but we need a lot of that as well. So let me get a little bit of metal. We're just going to farm on this little platform for a bit, get everything that we need. We've got the generator and stuff. We, we decided not to put it down on Carno Island, so we've still got the generator and all that stuff that we're going to need to like set up a little bit of a base, but I think we'll wait till morning and get some other stuff going here. All right, we actually decided on like a really, I don't know, it's like a really dangerous area or something like that. Like, this is like the scorched earth type area. I believe, it's not scorched earth, but it's more of like a savanna or something. It's it's really hot. There's like a lot of scorched earth spawns, like um, the thorny dragons and stuff like that. But fortunately, it's got cactus sap and everything we need. I'm just going through here, trying to figure out everything we need. All right. Dang, we need more fiber. Okay. We're going to have to get a sickle at some point because we can also get a bunch of silk from around here. These little flower, like, colored flowers. We'll get a silk. All right, there we go. We've got pants. Well done, well done. All right, so we also need a bed. Oh, I do have that learned? Okay, we definitely need a bed because I'm not trying to not be able to respawn. We're just going to set one of these down around here once I get enough resources for it. I'm gonna need quite a bit more stuff I think to set up a little platform for it as well. I'm gonna try and get as many arrows as we can because this is like a really dangerous area. I don't know why we're over here. We're gonna have to like relocate or something it I think but there's like a lot of good resource spawns over here as well so it's kind of a, a toss-up. I think what we're gonna do today is we need to go search for either a pteranodon or a griffin or something but we need a flyer. Alright guys, this game, I swear, it's out to get me. So, the server crashed, it came down, and when we logged back in, none of us were in the tribe. The server was, like, fine. Like, our base was still there. We just couldn't access it. We were kicked out of the tribe, and we all lost all of our characters. For some reason, it wiped, like, all the character files or something. This is official server, guys. This should not happen. And, uh, really unfortunate situation here, guys. So, I don't know. We have to start all over from the ground up. It's going to be kind of uh, a grind to get everything back going the way that it was, but we're dedicated. We're going to get back there, and we've got a lot, a lot of work ahead of us. Rip, rip. Okay, I was able to get back and get back some of the stuff because some of the bodies were still around. Even though our characters were, like, deleted, the bodies for them were still around. I was able to get the crossbow and stuff that I was... That I had on my body, unfortunately. We don't really have the levels and stuff, so I'm pretty much just a noob with some decent tools. We need to kill a lot of stuff. I'm killing these for chitin at the moment just because we need a lot of that. But we're going to have to keep on that grind. Oh my gosh. It's going to be a lot, of, a lot of wasted time there. Okay. We tamed over Morella Tops. We needed this thing for berries so badly since we're in this like scorched earth dino spawning area at the moment we figured we'd tame one of these up it's actually better than a trike in my opinion they're they're faster and they can hold a decent amount of stuff too i'm actually just taking this thing out farming metal with it we've got an rg knocked down we're, we're waiting to tame that thing up because it's gonna be a bit some sheep actually spawn in this area so we'll hopefully have a sheep for that, but I'm not sure. Okay. I might have to drop some of these berries. I'm just going to take the narco ones. I've been just dropping all the other ones, keeping all the narcos and stuff. Okay. All right, awesome. There we go. So I really like Ragnarok, and that's the thing about it is, like, we, don't, we couldn't get this on the island. It's just a whole different setting here 
Alright, I'm gonna gather as much as I can by hand. The metal's really scattered around, but there's a lot more of it that's like on the ground areas of Ragnarok, so that's really nice. I'm gonna finish mining this. We should be all good on this. Alright, the RG's got quite a bit to go. I've been meat taming a 135 saber. I was talking about sheep, and since we don't have a turret on, we can't really make it out to the highlands, but I wasn't able to find one over here, so he's been sitting as I farm. I've been just, like, using him as a storage bin for, like, farming and stuff, but I figured we'd tame this thing up. It's, it's been a, a lot of time he's been sitting here just eating normal meat it's hilarious we're gonna have this like we should have just done it with like cooked fish meat or something see how, how long we can make this last but yeah least efficient way to do it but it is a high level just like everything in Ragnarok unfortunately when you're trying to survive as a low level that kind of makes things difficult because it's it's hard to kill a lot of like level 140 things all right this RG is like pretty dang close to done Unfortunately, a lot of people got a little bit discouraged when uh, we lost all of our progress. So it's been just a few of us holding down the fort. We're getting this uh, back on on course, though. Unfortunately, when stuff like that happens, people get a little bit discouraged in this game. Especially, like, things like that. It's, like, so annoying that you have to go through situations where you lose your character, lose all your stuff. But, you know, that's what we've been dealing with with the arc since the beginning. So why should it be any different, right? All right, this nice meat tamed RG came out pretty good. We we're we we're so expecting, and I don't know on Ragnarok there are sheep everywhere, but the area we we're in, we knew that there were sheep there, but right when we needed it, they were gone. Just like you know, just like how it always works out. But it's okay. We've got this all tamed up, and we're all good. So I'm killing hyenas. They actually give a decent amount of XP, especially for like a new tame. So oh my god, this dude is just gonna make it difficult for me to get to all these hyenas is that vulture coming for me now the other thing I need is spoiled meat these give a decent amount of meat compared to anything else in this area so now we get to see like a battle between vultures and hyenas holy crap I do want to grab a few more of these actually though so if you don't mind I would like to kill as many of these as possible. They also give a lot of, like, tools and stuff. I don't know why the hyenas give so many good things. I, it doesn't really make sense to me. I feel like... Oh, God. This... Oh, no. This vulture... Does a lot of damage. Okay. We need to kill this. We need to get away from this vulture because... That thing is, like, ridiculously strong for some reason. It's probably, like, 150 or something crazy. I gotta land. This is not good. Uh, no, not good. That vulture, though. Okay, it's all good. No worries. No worries. We sur <laughs> we survived, or the RG survived. I didn't survive the vulture, but I'm just mining as much metal as physically possible. It's gonna be a lot of farm in the next few days, but the more we do now, the better off we'll be. Also, we need to get some weapons going, but really, that set us back so much. I actually had everything set up to have like a griffin trap set up on one of the mountains and stuff but that's not going to be happening because i had to turn that that griffin trap stuff into like a a taming pen so we could get some basic stuff like the umbrella top so it did set us back but hey i mean it's something that we're used to we're in it to to play the game so we're just going to continue along i want to farm metal as long as possible and we'll be right back all right, I've been out here spoiling a ton of meat. We need a lot of spoiled meat just to get narcotics going. Because we've got the morale tops, we can get a lot of narco berries really quickly. Now, spoiled meat is actually more of an annoyance. But we need a lot of narcotics just in case we find anything good to tame over here. We definitely need more stuff just to... I don't know. We need a lot of hide, basically. So we need something to ta like get hide. Because that saber tooth did not quite make it, unfortunately. Before we got a saddle for it, he was killed by other saber tooths and it was it was really sad. He sat there all day eating regular meat and uh, maybe that's why. Oh, I my Discord noise is on. Evidently, I apologize. I'm gonna kill this thing because we've got pteranodons on the way. Did I just fall? They like fall out 
If you get them on trees and stuff now, it's weird. But we need as much chitin as physically possible because we've got someone else taming up some pteranodons for us. We really needed to split up and start doing things because we got such a uh, such a far setback. As you could tell, my words are starting to get all jumbled up. I've, I haven't been sleeping because we need to get this back and <laughs> back in uh, working order, I guess. So I'm a little. Oh my God! What? Dude, what? <laughs> Alright. That did less than I thought it would, but we're good. I'm gonna actually try and get these guys. These are what I was after in the first place. Seriously, I'm trying to kill... Oh no. Oh no. Not good. Alright. Passive. Follow. Or we should be okay. This is why we upgrade move speed. Usually if I ever get dismounted, actually get dismounted on this map a lot, not like that, but from like micro raptors and stuff, you just gotta whistle follow and pass and freaking dip the other direction. Alright, we are alright. I'm gonna see how many more of those I can kill. I'm really just trying to get this Argy's weight to like 1k, something like that. And we are not quite, you know, rich enough to have grinders as much as I wish. What did that die to? Mantis? Oh. Our Mantis? Almost ran straight into that. That's why you gotta look forward when you're f driving and or flying. Is he gonna come over here? I just wanna get as many resources from this area as I can before heading out and kill as many hyenas as possible. So I'm gonna do the those things and we'll be right back. Alright, so we don't have too much in here and... I'm also dying of water, so don't 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 mind that. Um, but this is the little setup we've got. We've got stone on the outside for now. We're trying to cover it up a little bit. We've got our forges going right here. We don't have too much, and we're not too um, crazy advanced here at the moment, just because we've just been working on the base just now, because we haven't really put too much time into it. Um, we've just been using the uh, building supplies as like leveling, so that's why we've got thatch wood stone we've got a whole nice we've got a whole plethora of things going on in here we also got let me close this door that's our our most defended area we'll be upgrading this a lot but with that uh setback you know it's, we've just been a little bit behind and stuff but we'll be getting back into it this should be all metal here hopefully coming up at some point this one's actually out so i can might as well put that out it's just running off spark powder anyway but that's where we're going to stop for today. If you like this video, definitely hit that thumbs up and or subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. We've got a lot of action and stuff coming up. That is if the arc devs don't wipe us again. Have a great rest of your day, guys.